of thousands of young Americans found themselves half a world away from home in a land about which they knew almost nothing. And because it was, in effect, a civil war, the enemy was everywhere. As they moved out into the countryside, every hamlet was a potential nest of Viet Cong guerrillas. And every village hut a potential booby trap. The Viet Cong were on home ground and knew every inch of the territory. As American patrols appeared, they melted away, sometimes into foxholes leading down into what became an astonishing network of tunnels. Yeah. Hold, hold it, hold it, hold it! Man, I think that is a... booby trap, man. up here now too late oh! <laughs> yeah 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 we need backup Heavy air support, we're under fire! By war. I like a chicken. Oh man! Yeah, say your prayers. Oh no! You're dead now. Oh no! You're my prisoner now, boy. I surrender. I surrender. Coming with me. The Geneva Convention of 1929 stated that captors should treat prisoners in the same way their own soldiers were treated. Prisoners could work voluntary, but they should be paid. Make their first excursions from the nest. One of its countries. And back in America, I bet you we're not torturing it. Yeah, this violates the Geneva Convention. That's right. Oh, man. What? What? Yeah, that's that's right. Man. What? Okay. I'll take the food. <coughs> Unless you consider death. Oh, 